Good evening. After reaching dizzying heights upwards of 18,000 levels in the previous trading session, the BSE Sensex tumbled largely due to weak global markets. Stocks across the globe were under pressure amid fresh worries over Greek's financial condition. With Greece's financial woes intensifying, market players preferred to book some profits ahead of the eventful results season kicking off next week. Offloading was seen across the board. The oil and gas, metal and banking stocks were among the major losers, which dragged the BSE Sensex and NSC Nifty Index over 300 points and 90 points from their respective 52 weeks high. In addition, advanced decline ratio turned in favour of the bears for the first time in three days. Out of the total 2,957 stocks on the BSE, 1,678 stocks declined as against 1,198 advancing stocks, while 81 stocks remained unchanged. The BSE Sensex lost 256 points to close at 17,714 and the NSE Nifty fell 70 points to close at 5,304. Among the 30 components of the Sensex, 19 ended in the positive terrain and 11 were in the red. BSE Mid-Cap Index ended 0.4% lower and BSE Small Cap Index closed 0.38% lower. Among the sectorial indices, BSE Oil and Gas Index was down 1.88%, BSE Metal Index slipped 1.87% and the BSE Bank Index moved 1.65% lower. BSE Realty Index gained 0.55% and BSE IT Index moved 0.34% up. Losses in Sale, Hindalco Industries, HDFC Bank, ICICI Bank and Tata Steel pressured the Nifty. Nifty gainers comprised of Idea Cellular, BPCL, Infosys Technologies, DLF and Wipro. That's it for the day. Thank you and have a great evening.